sorry. Did I interrupt? Jonah Nicholas, really? Winston Barkley, is that really you? Well, you've aged terribly. Jonah, I don't need any of your negativity. I really don't care. I'm not really sure where all this drama is going, or how it started even, but um, you guys just need to work out this little feud, little disagreement, and then we can all be on our way, and I thought I could trust you, but apparently you can't actually trust your friends that you actually trust. You stole this invention. One that I tried so hard. Please. We're always lazy, and I've been informed that you're actually a millionaire now. What's your point? How did you become a millionaire? Out of all people. For all I know, you probably sell technology that you and I created together. And you ended up taking all the credit. Well, it's only because you disappeared. You make no sense. And neither do you. Oh, so guys, we're picking up on some really weird signals. Wait, it can't be. I mean, how is that possible? Oh, you're picking up on a signal that there's another teleporter. Someone else entered the dimension that Harper and that one dude is in. Yeah, exactly. What do you think that means? Well, that can only mean that Jonah Nicholas is in there with them. I'm still highly confused as to what's going on. Long story short, you need to free Margaret Barkley. To be honest, we don't know much either. All we know is that Addison told us to. I'm sorry, but it's against my policy to do such a thing without evidence or other cops. I'd love to help your whole detective game. It's not a game, but it's really confusing, and, and I have arrived. Please, we need help. Until there's further evidence, I cannot do anything. Sorry, and I wish you the best of luck. Say, where's Harper anyways? Um, she's, um, at a friend's house, yeah. Really? It's complicated, but I'm sure she'd love to tell you all about her adventures in a different dimension some other time. Until then, we have to go. If you're not going to help us, thank you so much for your, your time, and we hope you consider it. Bye! Well, would you boys like to join me on the couch? I'm just watching some football. Hello, please check in over here. Oh, oh I... Oh, Skyla, it's you. Go right ahead. Skyla! Hey, Auntie Sue. I... Just got done with my birthday party, and some drama went down, and uh, I'm ready to help you out again. I hope we can chat later about what happened at your party, and I'm so sorry I could not attend, darling, but, you know, patients here at the ER, they, they won't heal themselves. Yeah, it's okay, I understand. Well, for starters, you could help me out by organizing some documents from the file cabinets, because, well, things sort of look terrible in there right now. <laughs> Well, as I said, it's just a tad messy. <laughs> um, you just need to organize everything alphabetically by last name in the file cabinets. Thank you so much for helping me out all these times that you come over to the hospital just to help out your aunt. Well, you're practically my best friend. I love you so much and I couldn't have asked for a better niece. <sighs> I'll be back in half an hour to check up on you and then maybe we can go on a coffee break or something. Thank you. Bye. Okay, let's get started. Hopefully this will take my mind off everything. I just need a break from people in general. What's this? Oh my gosh. Just can't believe this. Why would you do that? You broke it. Oh great, I love breaking things. Hey! Get your paws off that. Oh, hey guys, calm down. Take this. Harper, you were once Skyla's friend, and then I totally brainwashed her into thinking that you were a terrible friend. I mean, from how I treated her, yeah, I sort of am a terrible friend. What I'm saying is, she's completely on my side now. Even if Addison or Harley try to apologize, it's not gonna work. <sighs> That's it. 
I'm suing you. Good luck trying to find out my name or where I live. Guys, we need to go now. Let's leave him here. No, if I'm staying here, we all stay here. I'll hold him off, you two go. No, we... No, we, we came all this way, we're not gonna leave you. Your disappearance is why I started investigating this mystery in the first place. At least now you know where I am, but if you stay here, you none of us will be able to go back. No, we're not gonna leave you here. Trust me, Harper's stubborn, I would know that. Then you leave me no choice. Hey! Winston! Goodbye, you two. No, no, Winston, no. Why would you do that? Now none of us have a way of getting back. Well, that's your problem for coming here in the first place. I'll never see my daughter again. We can work together if you want, but only if you promise not to lie, not to cheat. I know you hate me. You've always been jealous of me too. That's why you, you wanted to send me here. I will not work with you. Don't care if we used to be best friends because we're not anymore. Where are you going? I'm going to go explore this new dimension. Away from you. Life is sometimes so unfair and makes no sense. Skyla! Are you such a Russian? I have a folder, and it's for Anthony and Ethan. Actually, in Harper's house right here. Anthony, Ethan, I think there's something you want to see. What? What does that make any sense? I'm not sure. I was at the hospital. I was organizing some records and that's what I found. Way, there's no way that this is accurate. Well, you guys are technically adopted, so it could be possible. Skyla, you're helping us? This mystery? No. I'm not helping us. I'm only helping Ethan and Anthony. Well, isn't this enough proof now? We can take this to the police station. Well, that and a bail. And then our mom would be free. Well, you kids need a ride? Oh my gosh, we're getting some really strong signals right now. I think that they're on their way back. But it, one of the machines broke. How do we know if it's them? For all we know, it could be Jonah Nicholas, and our friends are dead and forgotten in a different dimension. Oh my gosh, they made it back. <sighs> yes, we made it back. <laughs> well, where's Winston Barkley? Not everyone gets a happy ending. Some had to make sacrifices. Jonah Nicholas actually broke one of the teleporters, so we only had one. Winston sent us back. So you're saying they're both stuck over there, with each other? Well, they were friends once. They can be friends again. Yeah, they were friends once. I need to go apologize to Skyla. Nice chat, I'll see you guys all in a bit. Well, here she is. Ethan, Anthony. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry your father and I couldn't keep you and raise you and so many things has happened to our family. I know nothing can replace the years that we missed together. Thanks for texting me. Oh, wait, what? It's crazy, isn't it? Skyla? You're seriously going to apologize to me at a time like this? Not exactly. I need you to follow me. And I know that we're not exactly on the same page right now, but if you follow me, I can explain everything. I don't know. No, it's about your father. Something happened to him. You can't be serious. I'm really, really sorry. I do have to say I'm not surprised. He always did things like that.
he could never really control his emotions. I don't have a mom anymore. What am I going to do? Where am I going to live? I'm not really sure about all that stuff, but I do know that you will always have friends. We're really sorry about your party, but we hope you understand now. Why do I feel like I'm obligated to join this group hug? Winston's in there too. Oh man, never in a million years did I think I would be doing a group hug. Thanks guys. Well thanks mom and dad for being the best possible parents in the world. Really happy you found your biological mother. That we are gonna miss you two boys very much. Hugs. But we hope you enjoy this new addition to your family. Oh, it's a girl. I've always wanted a girl. Thank you so much for adopting me. Yeah, and so I thought that was super weird and everything. But I mean, wasn't that an adventure? That was pretty fun. Got it. What?